Well, long lines and long waits. That's what New Jerseyans encountered today as the Motor Vehicle Commission reopened around the state. Closed for four months, the backlog was easy to see with overwhelming crowds in a situation some described as organized chaos. Matt Petrillo is in Camden with the MVC Mayhem. Matt? Yuki, there is no one here at the vehicle center now. The office is closed, but for much of the day, a huge line of people wrapped around the perimeter of this parking lot, although many of them were told to go home to come back tomorrow or another time because the office here reached capacity. People have been out here since like 4.30 in the morning. It's just really frustrating. While the line kept growing here at the vehicle center in Camden Tuesday, Keegan McGovern's patience was thinning. I feel like they should have had this figured out earlier. She waited seven hours to get her license. Juggy Lewis needs his ID renewed to start working again. You know how many people have been waiting to get a job and his job's out here just because the ID is in the fire? Over at the vehicle center in Cherry Hill, some people brought lawn chairs with them because the wait was so long. Getting tired of sitting around. It's hot, humid. I mean, you're waiting. The line wraps around the whole building. In Turnersville, Chopper 3 found what looks like a couple hundred people in line. But after vehicle centers were closed for four months, we're told the wait was worth it. Yes, because I'm tired of riding with expired temp tag. So <laughs> I call it riding dirty. So if you come, just keep in mind that have your mindset that you're going to be here for a long time. Yeah, it's nice to know that someone at least has a sense of humor. Meantime, officials want to remind people that they can do most of the services at these locations online. Reporting live in Camden, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Matt, thank you.